I've had literally so many requests to see the all-time Rams team, but honestly, I don't have any coins left. So today, we're going to be jumping in with a 2016-2017 LA Rams. I guess are the LA Rams now. And we're going to see if we can win the Super Bowl. So this is honestly a mold that I really don't venture into a whole lot. If you guys enjoy these videos, definitely let me know. Um, I'm going to go over kind of some like the untouchable players. So pretty much everybody at the receiving core option can go. None of these guys need to stay the same. Ty Gurley, definitely you cannot touch. Jared Goff, I'd like to say he can stay, but honestly, we are open to trade him. On the defense, a lot of people are open game. Aaron Donald, I don't want him to go. Robert Quinn, depending on who I can get, I might want to trade him. Um, and then EJ Gaines and Tremaine Johnson, those are going to be tough. Um, I kind of want them to say, same with TJ McDonald, we definitely need a new free safety. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go uh, on the free agent block and we're going to see who we can pick up. All right, so looking at these free agents, there's not a whole lot here. Honestly, I kind of want to pick up this Laurent Landry or Jaquan Jarrett. It's pretty soft. They're both uh, very similar in salary. Jaquan Jarrett is just a little bit more. Laurent is a tad bit older, but honestly, this is just a one-year thing. So I'm going to go ahead and sign Laurent Landry. Sure, Mike, that's why you got him. Okay, so honestly, defense is looking pretty darn good. We have Laurent Landry, TJ McDonald, EJ Gaines, Tremaine Johnson. That's pretty good secondary. And then the defensive line is honestly our best defensive, our best defensive trait. We have pretty good linebackers. The offense is really gonna be ah, it's gonna be spotty. I might have to put Jared Goff on the trade block, depending on how he does. But let's go ahead and send this preseason and see how we do. Guys, I decided to sim through the entire preseason, and the worst thing possible just happened. My man Todd Gurley is out for seven weeks. Oh my gosh. Uh, we're just going to sim week one, and we're going to see how we do. And based on that, we might need to do some upgrades. Really? The Rams caught an L the first game. You got to be, man, come on. Wow, we really lost 31 to 10 at home. Come on, man. I'm, Jesus. Ooh, that's not good. That is not good. Jared Goff, 31.8 passer rating, 140 yards, zero touchdowns, two interceptions. Oh, my goodness gracious. That is bad. In terms of receivers, we really didn't have any. So I'm going to simulate maybe two or three more games. I'm not going to attribute this bad game to Jared Goff because he's a bad quarterback. I'm gonna I'm gonna play it safe. I'm gonna say it's because he have, doesn't have any receivers. We'll see what the next couple games say though. Wow. Nope. Okay. The Rams caught another L. This is uh, oh my goodness. We lost 38 to 13. So we can't score. We can't play defense. That sounds about right. Okay. So I'm on the free agent list right here, and I see Marcus Colson is available to pick up. Honestly, we we can't catch the ball. We can't do anything. So I'm gonna see if I might be able to give Jared Goff one receiving option. If if he can't come through with this. It's about to go down. All right, so now Jared Goff has a better center. He has another receiving option in Marcus Colston. That's an 83 tight end, 84 receiver, 85 receiver, and an 81 receiver. He's got to at least be able to do something. Come on, he's got to do something. You got to be kidding me. They lost again. All right, now in all honesty, they scored more points. They scored 28 points, so hopefully it's because of Colston. All right, I'm going to give Jared Goff one more week because we scored 28 points that game. So if we can't make some crazy victory here, like we're talking blockbuster trades are about to happen. Success! Oh my goodness, the Rams won. Let's go. The Rams finally got a victory. They're scoring more points. Honestly, they're scoring more points. 36 points is pretty darn good. We'll go ahead and look at some of the player stats. Hopefully, Jared Goff did a little bit. Oh, Jared Goff, 123.8 passer rating, two touchdowns, no picks. That's exactly what we want to see, honestly. I want to see what the receivers are looking like. Kenny Britt and Marcus Colston both did great. That's exactly what we want. We need to turn the season around, honestly. Honestly, I'm looking to get a big running back right now. We're going to trade Trey Mason and the number one overall pick. I'm looking to get an absolute stud. Are you crazy? Are you out of your mind? I literally doubt there's no way that they're going to... Yeah, no. Come on. You know you want to trade Dougie Doug. You know you want... Doug oh, really? Okay, you need a left tackle? We got Greg Robinson. You want to you take this one? Nope. Okay, sounds good. Come on, Kansas City. Come on, Kansas City. Nothing. Wow. You know, you say you say you want a better positional player, but people like the first overall pick. What? You need four? Come on. I didn't want to have to do this, but EJ Gaines, you're on the block. I want Jamal... We got Jamal! Jamal Charles, welcome to the squad! Okay, 
All right, this might help the offense out just a little bit. We got Jamal Charles, Kenny Britt, Marcus Colston, and Jared Goff. Now, the defense did take a little bit of a hit, but we still have Quinn Cobles out there. We still got Quinn Cobles. We still got Aaron Donald and Robert Quinn. Now, cornerback position is a little spotty, so ugh, I, I don't know how that's going to work. Honestly, let's just see how it plays out. Hey, oh my goodness. Goodness. Rams got another W. The Rams, the Rams got another W. Let's let's see what we did. Let's see what we did. We're we're coming to play now. We got Jamal Charles. We got a, we got actually a good offense. This is kind of weird. This is honestly kind of weird. We got the W. Let's see what did really well. Oh my God! 501 total offense. Yo, Jared Goff. He just needed some weapons. Rams, learn from this. He just needed some weapons. Yo, Jamal. Jamal Charles. 25 rushes. 107. Oh my. Yes, let's go. Lance Kendrick's okay. You did good. Kenny Britt did good. Uh, Colston, you honestly, you could have done better. You could have done better. Um, this is looking good. This is looking really good so far. Uh, let's go ahead and sim like two or three games, or maybe to the middle of the season. And we'll see where we're at. Okay, that did not work out well. We are now two and five. We were two and three, and we won two games in a row, and then we lost three games in a row. That is the Rams for you. Let's see what happened. All right, so 24 to 13. We lost 24 to 13 to the Browns. Look who's talking. And then the game right after that, Jared Goff, no touchdowns, one interception, 63 passer rating. I think we need to trade one of our defensive linemen for a quarterback. I, I think we have to. Guys, so I just made like the biggest new move ever. I simulated towards middle of the season and the trade center is locked Try it. so in the nfc west we are actually last we are ranked 26th in the nfl we are really having a rough season honestly um yikes we are on a two game losing streak we don't have a single home win that's hey you should be back in st louis okay you should stand crocky you you hearing me you listen to me you, you should be back in st louis boy have you lost your mind because i'll help you find it now since there really isn't anything i can do in terms of trades i'm gonna see if there's a free agent that i can sign Hopefully there's somebody here and I'm gonna pick up a cornerback or a safety. We really need some secondary help. I'm honestly gonna try and get Antonio Cromartie and see how he plays. This is not looking good offense. Uh, we're gonna have, uh, what's his name, back pretty darn soon. Looks like Kenny Britt is up in overall. Man, and then the free agent that I signed is out for six weeks. Perfect. Okay, well, hopefully they'll be back soon. Let's go ahead and sim a couple games. Hey, we got the victory. Let's go, man. Okay. Okay, we got the victory. We held the opponent to only 13 points. We can attest that to maybe the signing of Antonio Cromartie. I don't know. Uh, it looks pretty good. Let's actually go back to the box score and see their total offense. Look at that. Their total offense was only 248 yards. I think Antonio Cromartie helped it out. Offensive passing yards, 153. That's honestly not very good. Um, we can look and see, yikes, Sean Hill is their quarterback. As a Rams fan, I, I, I can feel your pain. <laughs> this next one should be a cakewalk. We should be four and five. Hopefully, we can be at least 500. Uh, this is going to be tough. We're playing the Bears. Honestly, we choked versus them last year. Hopefully, we can just sim this week and everything will go perfectly. Let's go. That's exactly what we wanted. We got the W. We're four and five. Let's go. I mean, let's see how we did. I think I feel like we did pretty darn good. Oh, my goodness. This was an absolute destruction. They did not even score until the fourth quarter. That was probably in garbage time. Look at this. Our defensive line is so good. Only 67 offensive rushing yards, 143 in the passing yards. Let's see how we looked. Oh, my God. Jared Goff played incredible. Color played awful. I don't even need to look at this anymore. Let's, let's get to 500. We're playing the Ravens, so this is going to be tough, man. I'm We're going to see. We're going to see what's going to happen. Hopefully, we get the W. Sometimes the Rams come through like this. Sometimes they just beat the really good teams and then lose to the worst ones. The Ravens were 6-3. and three. We better be at 500 when I look at this screen next. It's coming up. Here it is. Ah, we took the L. And again, right now, Cardinals and Rams are tied in their division. The Seahawks are just freaking going nuts right now. So I just want to at least beat the Cardinals and the Niners in our division. Hopefully we can do that. Honestly, we really need a middle linebacker. So I just signed the first one that I saw, Jasper Brinkley. He's like a 77 overall. We need some people better because the middle linebacker we had right now was like a trash player. He was down to like a 63 overall. And what do you know? We took an L. I mean, was it close? Was it, was it at least close? I mean, come on. I know I know we took a loss, but can it at least not be that awful? Oh, 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 my. 
41 to 13. Try it, try it, try, 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 try it. Man, oh man, I can't believe we took it all that time. That's that's honestly not good. This season is, is pretty much done. I'm going to go ahead and send to the playoffs. We are four and eight right now. Honestly, I don't think anything is going to happen that crazy. I just want to see how this season ends up turning out. Hopefully, we can randomly make the playoffs. I'm not going to make any other changes to the roster. The Seahawks ended with a 14 and two record. The Rams... 6 and 10 and the Cardinals 6 and 10 that sucks man the Seahawks ended the year on an 8 game winning streak that's crazy the Rams obviously couldn't do it Oh, that really sucks. We ended up going 6 and 10. That's really not what we want, but that's the Rams. I mean, you guys can look at their schedule. That's pretty much what they go every single year. And just for fun, I'm going to simulate to the Super Bowl. We're going to see who won, and I guess we'll just take a look at the stats. Oh, my God. No. No. No way. San Diego won the Super Bowl. Are you kidding me? That is ridiculous. The Chargers? The Chargers won the Super Bowl. Oh my God. We got to look at these stats. Phillip Rivers, that's not even that good. What? Who, who played so well? Who played so. How? How, Sway? How, Sway? Yo, how Aaron Rodgers going to lose the Super Bowl? No way. What? Jared Cook? Hi, ah, Jared Cook. Coming up on Clutch, Mr. Butterfingers. Dang, that's crazy. All right, if you guys enjoy this video and want me to do more teams, let me know the team you want to do. If you've gotten this far, I really appreciate it. I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.